Welcome to another video teacher tip with Mr. Long and we're going to look at how we can convert a web page into a PDF. Now we've done this video before with a browser, but this video is going to focus how we can do it on your phone. This happened to me once I was about to get on a plane and I remembered you can't really use your Wi-Fi connection on a plane and it might not have reception up there. So I said, how about if I save this website as a document and then I can still read it on the plane when I can use my phone or you might want to send a document to your students. I I had this as well where students didn't have access to the internet and they couldn't regularly see the website so it was better for me to just send it to them as a document what i'm going to do is i'm going to go to the actual website so here's a website example i want to send this to my students and they sometimes can't access it online so i'm going to send it to them as a document so i'm going to click on those three dots there at the top and one of the options is to share this document. So I'll click on share and there you'll see options like to screenshot it or to copy the link, etc. So I'm going to scroll to the right over there. So let's just scroll further up and you'll notice that there is an option to print. So long we're not connected to a printer, that's fine. We're still going to print it. So when I click on that print option, you'll notice, ah, there's a save as PDF option. If it's not listed there, make sure that you select it. And then these options over here can flow down and you can select which options you want. Maybe you want to have it as an a4 size document so you can change these settings as you wish once you are ready you can then click on that little button there which will download this website as a pdf and so when i go here it'll ask me where do you want to save it i'm going to save it to my documents folder and then click on that save button there we go now if i go to my files i will go to my documents over there and there you will see there's the file over there and then i can open it up in adobe so that i can view it or i can share it or i can send it via whatsapp so if I click on it, it'll open it up in Adobe Acrobat Viewer. And so there you can see your document. I'm looking at that document offline. I'm not using internet to access that particular website. And there we go. And that's how you can save a website as a PDF. For more teacher tips, go to our YouTube channel, click on that subscribe button, support the channel by sharing us with your other teacher friends so that we can help them. And leave us a comment about anything that you want us to discuss. And remember, don't do it the long way. Do it the Mr. Long Way.